Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to MTM Tech Tips. Today I'll be showing you an updated version of how to mine Zcash, as the old video on my channel is now outdated and is very, very hard to follow. So as I said in the previous video, Zcash is a very private crypto and can be used for payments. So one Zcash is equal to $155 at the time of filming the video. So it is not just another altcoin, it's actually worth something. Let's get right into mining it then. So guys, the first thing you want to do is download and install the ZEC Wallet Lite program. Um, this is a Windows program, not a Linux program, so sorry if you're on Linux. Um, press the uh, download button and it will take you to this page and then click the windows.msi installer and it will start installing the ZEC wallet. Now this will this program will give you a wallet address which you can paste in the miner. This is later on in the video. But. So once it's installed, click on it and Windows has protected my PC here. Now don't worry if this comes up. Um, basically, all mining software and mining wallets are flagged as malware. Um, don't know why, but if you trust these guys, press run anyway. If you don't trust these guys, well then, stop watching the video. So, it will now configure the ZEC wallet live. And the next thing you want to do is install the EWDF CUDA miner. Now, I'm going to install version 0.4 Pro for Windows. Go down to the Assets tab and click Miner 0.4pro.zip and install a zip. Now guys, one thing um, happens here and as I said before, it's because Windows thinks that um, Windows thinks that mining software is flagged as malware. Um, it's not malware guys, it's just um, any mining software is flagged up as malware. So what you guys want to do is go to Chrome's download tab and press keep dangerous file. Once you've done that, you can now show in folder and unzip um, your EWBF CUDA miner. And that's it for part one, let's go to part two. So this is part two guys, the next thing you want to do is now configure your pool in the mining software. Um, so you've got to find a pool, but I recommend Flypool as this is a well-known and trusted pool with an easy to use GUI. Copy the server that you want, so I am closest to EU, so I'm going to copy the EU server. Now go to um, your downloads folder. Um, which is here, and go to ZEC Miner 0.4 Pro. Now go to the miner.cfg config text file. When you've done this, you want to go down to the hashtag main server area, and in the server part, paste the URL that you just copied. Next thing you guys want to do is use the right port. Now I'm going to use the Stratum port as this is the easiest to configure, but if you want to use an encrypted Stratum port, go ahead. Uh, so the port is 3333. Okay, in the user tab now, you guys, what you want to do is copy your wallet address from the ZEC Wallet Lite application into this. Now you can use a shielded or transparent address. Um, Shielded has private keys and is encrypted. Um, for ease of use, I'm just going to use the transparent address. So I'm going to press copy address and paste it in the user area. Now guys, after user, you just want to place a dot. Um, so this is a worker name, this is what you call worker name. And this will um, make sure that the pool that we're in recognizes that this is the right device so i'm going to call it gtx 750 save the file close it okay so now you're almost ready to run the miner 
but first you want to go to your fly pool and paste your wallet address into the search bar and this will bring up our dashboard now we are ready to run the miner so go to the folder that it's in and double click on miner.exe now it's initiated the miner as you can see it's selected flypool.org with our port it's selected our uh, device zero gtx 750 cuda so cuda is a compute unit on a gpu and you can select it um, it's basically like a number crunching unit let's put it that way and now our gpu is doing the work as you can see flypool have sent us some more work uh, from their server so i'm gonna actually stop this mining because it will lag my recording but after about 10 or so minutes it will come up as an active miner over here in the flypool dashboard um yes yeah, so guys that's all you have to do to mine zcash if you would like to see more tutorials like this on this channel then hit subscribe and like the video share to your friends please it would help me out a lot see you in the next one